Hey Royal Family, welcome to my General Hospital Daytime Drama Channel. I am your hostess, the Daytime Drama Queen. I have your General Hospital Recap for Tuesday, September 5th. Now, let's get into it. At Carly Spencer's home, we see Michael Corinthos and Carly Spencer discussing Sonny's arrest. Carly asks Michael if he turned Sonny in. Michael says no. Someone must have gotten hold of the flash drive. Dex Heller drops by. Michael asks Dex, did you turn Sonny in? Dex says no. Michael then asks Dex, what happened to the flash drive? Dex says that he gave it to Jocelyn. Jo Jocelyn drops by and Carly asks her, did you tip Sonny off to the feds? Jocelyn says no. She tells Carly that after you destroyed the flash drive, I gave it to Dex. Michael says, what did you do with it, Dex? Dex said, my intentions were to burn the flash drive, but I got distracted and threw it away. Michael then tells him that the feds must have gotten hold of the flash drive. This could send Sonny to prison for the rest of his life. We then see Sonny Corinthos being interrogated by the feds regarding Pikeman securities. Sonny says that he imports coffee and that he won't say anything else until his attorney arrives. Diane Miller comes in and halts the interview. An agent later informs Diane that they are holding Sonny for 72 hours. Another agent presents a file with pictures of the Pikeman deal. The agent says, bingo. Lucy Cole and Maxie Jones argue over Tracy's proposal of getting 75% of the deception. Maxie says they will need to agree until they find a solution. Dante Falconeri tells Sam McCall that Sonny's charges are serious. If he's convicted, he will go to prison for the rest of his life. They then try to figure out who tipped off the feds. At Pentonville, we see Cyrus Renault telling Drew Kane that Sonny has been arrested on federal charges and he can't protect you now. Cyrus then challenges Drew to an intense game of chess. Mason Gatlin goes to see Ava Jerome at the art gallery. Ava demands Nicholas's body. Mason said that he needs to work out some logistics and then she will get Nicholas back. He then leaves. We see Austin Gatlin Holt returning home. He calls out to Nicholas. Nicholas walks through the door. He has been jogging. He tells Austin that he needs to regain his strength. Austin tells him that Ava never intended to kill him. He tells Nicholas that he needs to go back to Port Charles to see Spencer, his son, and his mother. Austin asks him, what will you do when you get back to Port Charles? Nicholas says, I can't go back just yet. Well, royal family, that's it for today's recap. Please send me your thoughts, your comments, and your theories, and we will discuss later. Until then, this has been the Daytime Drama Queen saying, ta-ta.